the winning position against Serbia. Kopchar gets the third set underway. Russia leading 2 0 here in Sofia against Bulgaria. That came back with a little bit of interest from Mozeski. You cannot tip like that against this Russian team. Bulgaria have just found out. There's Georgi Bratoev, who uh, turned his ankle in yesterday's game. He he's OK. He was just a strain. He'll be back in action pretty quickly. That's nicely done. Time Bulgaria gets a point. The fans will let Russia know about it. I inside my own world of make believe. Kids screaming in the cradles, profanities. Some days I feel skinnier than all the other days. Some days I can't tell if my body. It's hard to breathe, but that's all right. Hey, sir, for Muzeski. That came down really quickly. But again, great passing, and straight away, Russia run the middle. Mozeski puts the ball down. It was a monstrous serve. But Russia just taking all that energy out of the ball. It's high. It's in a position where Kobjar can go to the middle. Mozeski has no trouble putting it away. Kobjar with the serve now for Russia. Russia had that covered right up to the moment Uchikov hit the ball, that is. Zerski again through the middle. Gotsev's serve is one of the most ungainly serves and the one serve that you're watching him and every time you're on tenterhooks as to whether or not he's going to get the ball actually over the net. No trouble with Mazeski getting I it over the net and in court. Karpilkov there with the serve. Oh, what a dig that is! That's incredible! Wonderful, wonderful points! And it's all about Russia's defense. It was an absolute mammoth hit down the line from Bulgaria. But Kovshar just held his ground. It comes off of him. It comes up beautifully then as it's recycled. And Muzeski then has the swing. Amazing, amazing volleyball.
kids Once again, deep breath as he gets himself ready for the jump serve. He's got the overpass, Mazeski over the top. No chance for Bulgaria. Serving is so, so important in volleyball. It's not just a means to start a rally. Those days are long gone. Even if you're just beginning, you're just starting out playing volleyball, serving is your opportunity to score a point without anybody else having to help you. No one has to set you the ball, no one has to dig you the ball. It's already in your hands. And that went straight into the hands of the Bulgarian block and Gliuka is put down. The cross court angle, he knows it, he apologizes straight away as he's turned it into the block. Overcut that one to the line. Bulgaria have the point. Chikov will serve. Kaliuka make sure of it. And we're into the second technical timeout, just as we were in the last set. Russia leading 16 <laughs> That's an excellent swing from Uchikov to see he had the line available. At this level, when a player goes up to hit the ball and they're above the height of the net, they're looking at the ball and then their peripheral vision is telling them what's in front of them. Whether there's a gap, whether there's hands, whether there's a gap between blockers. They'll also be able to see the antenna depending on where they are, but their main focus is on the ball and a huge amount of peripheral vision is used when attacking in volleyball. Zeski now for Russia. That looks to be in. That looked like it's an ace serve. They're going to challenge it. Yes, they are. Looked like it caught that baseline. Well, that looks can be deceiving. Zeski sure he's got it in. He's getting himself ready. In fact, he's going to have to wait. It's not been challenged. It's been given. Nothing much for the fans to shout about at the moment, even when they do see themselves on the big screen.
challenge was needed in the end. Russia being given the ace. Menchev looks like he towed the line, but he's got away with it. Zeski gets the side out anyway. 